Here's the walk with the dirty glasses. Cleaned the lens, forgot the glasses. Try the other one. So today's walk is, if you're watching on catch up, we're going to walk from Veronica's, which is just up here, towards the Monkey Beach Club, see how far we can get in half an hour, turn around and come back along the main road and come back down past Linica's and Tramps. So that'd be quite good. And we'll see you in a minute. Everything's locked. So we're going up steps. Hey, good morning, Dave. Uh, I'll get around this little bit here. Morning, Sarah. Morning, Craig. Morning, Una. They're all coming in thick and fast now. Bernie, good morning. What's oh, his wheelchair friend? There we go. Beautiful morning. Not so warm, but nice. So there we are up at Honeyles. Let's walk this way for two seconds and have a look at this nice. Statue. Statue. Can't see a thing. Yamil Omar. Where am I going? Oh, yeah. Can we actually see? Take my life in my hands. So this is where we left off. I want to say yesterday, but it was actually a week over a week ago. <laughs> CC Veronica's one, Centro Commercial. So it looks slightly different in the day. Thanks for supporting the channel. Good morning, everybody. Rene. I have a break time. My work. Cool. Good morning to everybody for sunny, chilly Bournemouth. And Catherine. Oh, my honey. Morning, Christina. Tim. We're walking with you. I'm Catherine from Cork. My Rosanne. Roger, morning, 2nd of November. Evie Blue, good morning, everybody. There we go. So I'm sticking my sunglasses on now. Let's see if we can get walking. So, Bindi Casino, outlet stores. In the background there is the Hotel Gala, four star. And Envy, 
It does look like the Irish bar shut there. Looks smaller in the uh, in the mornings. KFC and Subway both closed. Well, it was only 9.30 or thereabouts. Mackie D's. There was actually a oh, mass here in there where you can get real medicine open 24 hours. So this strip's looking pretty quiet this morning. So we're still in Leicester Americas at the moment because the Papagao Beach Club is the last thing in Leicester Americas before we go to Costa Adeje. For those of you not sure how to pronounce Adeje, the J is, a, is an H. Cinematic. So this Barranco here is actually the border between Las Americas and Costa Adeje. In the distance there you can see the Hard Rock Hotel and we're behind that. Uh, I can walk down here and over the bridge, yeah, let's do that. I'll show you a bit of the seaside. Oh, I do like to be beside the seaside. Oh, I do like to be beside the sea. Oh, I do like to stroll upon the pom 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 where the brass bands play. Tiddly on pom pom. There's a ferry in the background. Bridge. And now we're in Costa Adeje. Not to be confused with Costa Coffee. Morning, Sally Ann. So there are beds here. People are asking about whether there are beds. Looks like they've been put out. In the distance there, there's a price list. Looks like six euros. Playa La Troya. Lovely morning. Like a mare is still sort of like misty. Play misty for me. Though in the distance, you might well just be able to see a little bit of the outline there. Nice little beach. Supposed to be golden sand, imported. Well, it's like it's been slowly mixed with the black sand. <laughs> so, Aquilia de Hamacas, from nine till six, and 10 till seven on a summer. So, six euros, including tax which is the IGIC, which is the VAT here, which is 7% on most things. So, up to the steps. Oh, I'm sorry. Here, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 
Sorry about that. My mask just clipped to my magnetic microphone. So we're here by Hotel Troyer. Gives us a nice view of the whole of Costa Adeche. There you go. So I'll see what you guys are saying. Ah. Okay. Autism down, what's the weather like today? 28. Actually there it says 9.40, 12.10, which is the 12th of October, and 24 degrees it says. Morning everybody. I thought the Canary Islands were tax free. No sir, we're a special tax um, area, but we do have VAT, and the VAT is called IGIC, and uh, so a general general tax basically, and it's seven percent on most things. I think alcohol, tobacco is a bit more, but typically it's seven percent. So that's why we can't buy stuff from Amazon, because Amazon don't like exporting stuff to the Canary Islands. And if you do buy something and they do export it, then they'll charge you the 20 whatever percent it is IBA, uh, which is the Spanish VAT. And then they'll stick a $30 charge on it for fun and, and charge you 7% on the rest, on the lot. So it's not really worth buying online here unless you can get somebody to export it as a net. And then it sticks, stays in the Duena for, for, uh, for how long? A long time for about a week and then they'll deliver it. I think items under 150, you don't bother, but anything above that, you're gonna get uh, hammered. So that's really weird. I've noticed uh, you can go to Toman DE, which is a music shop that does electronics. They'll deliver to you um, with less tax, but. Uh. Morning, Claire. Hey, Bremish love. There are tourists, yes there are, Simon Parent. Do they put sunbeds out on the beach now? They, they do here. I saw a guy's pointing out this morning. And morning, Moira. Morning, Betarelli. Uh, hello, Tim. In finally for the week, temperature might reach a dizzy heights of 50 degrees, says Mark. Well, okay, it's okay, it's a morning. Be there in six days. And we've done the weather like Dave Wallace. When in Tenerife, doing great early morning walk. Hi, Tim. When in Tenerife, great doing an early morning walk. Oh, yeah, when in Tenerife, okay. I thought I was going to say weird in Tenerife. Morning, Ian, how are you? It is quite clear today. And Keris, good morning. Ray, we already said. Press the like button, thank you very much. Morning, Tim, lovely to see Jill live yesterday. So fun in the comments. <laughs> I haven't read the comments from yesterday, actually. I was too busy concentrating on the people. So uh, I, haven't, um, I haven't gone through it yet, but I will today. Don't worry. Right, let's get my glasses back on. See what everybody's talking about. Do me a favour, leave it out. So these are the Socaristas, which are the uh, people who save your life. Lifesavers, SOS, save our souls. Salvamento Socorissum. Now, coming up towards the Monkey Beach Club. There's the back end of Hotel Troy. Ah. Had a time share for 30 years, cool. On it, Anne. Daughter's over there at the moment. Stopping at Hotel Ryu, not far from Little Junior. Yeah, exactly right, Ian. It's just around the corner. In fact, we can see it from our house. 
<laughs> Socceristas, take your life in their hands. Very good, Stuart. Very good. Award of the day goes to Stuart for such a wonderful comment. So this is Monkey Beach Club. I can never tell whether it's open or shut these days. So if we go this way, we got to go up and down steps. Oh, it's open because of the cleaning. You got rid of all the, the greenery though. Well, that's quite nice. So I'm going to go down these three steps, four, sorry. Oops, up, up. And up these. And go and see me brothers. This is here no evil. Actually, no, it's. I'm not sure what I'm doing, brother. Met the owner of the Monkey Beach Club, says Flemish Love. And Smiler from New Zealand. Hi, guys. No, that's Palm Beach Club, Tim. Oh dear. Looks like Monkey Beach Club to me. That's what I was saying. Ah, you were saying you're staying in the Palm Beach Club, okay. So, there's Kuala Lumpur which I thought was the capital of Malaysia, but there you go. Is it? Got a dollar a pint? Oh, a dollar fifty a pint. And three euros fifty for breakfast over there. Cool dude. Besami. Kiss me, it means. Besami. Seafood restaurant. So there's a lot more people now. Guy riding past the no bicycle sign. There's a doggy. Looks like he's after the bike guy. So which way do we go? Do we go down or up? I think we'll go down and then come back up. And then go past... Where are we going past? Los Agaves, that's the one. That'll be a nice little trip for you. So Dan's still in Ireland, so I'm not going to go past this shop today. Oh, nice sound here. Let's, go, let's stay here for a while. I like these benches, because you can sit either way. Let me show you. So. You can either sit this way, looking out to sea, or if you pull this, you can sit the other way. It's very clever. And it says, don't forget to social distance. I know, I know we should be walking, but let's just have a look, see what you said. All the location. Very excited about staying there now. Cool dude. Oh, across the road, Moira, okay. Well, we got 83 people watching and 39 thumbs up, so 50%. There you go. Thank you very much, guys. We've been on nearly 20 minutes now. So we've got another 10 minutes view, then we turn around and come back another way. So you're not bored. I'm bored. Okay, so let's get up. 
Go past happy feet where the fish eat your feet. Oh. That's me in 10 years. Morning, Tim. I've many happy hours sat on those benches, says Michael. Yeah, me too. Well, minutes, I would say. <laughs> in fact, that's the first time I've sat on those benches. So this looks quite nice. So Coco Jambo, got to keep me, got to keep talking. So this is Restaurant Mania. Restaurant Mania, there you go. And it's a gelataria or helados, which is ice cream. And uh, there's no music playing. The sound's coming out of speakers, but there's no music. I'm getting old, aren't I? What used to be here? I can't remember what used to be here. I remember there's one guy took a picture here every day on, uh, on Facebook. So this is the Sal Etienne shopping centre. And Bar Berlin, there you go. Meet Silt. Silt's an island, a German island. Restaurant Marco Polo. Nobody in there dragging me in for breakfast or dollar pints. We got Bora Bora. Nobody dragging me in there for dollar pints either. I don't even know whether they're open or not or whether they're just not open yet. Looks like not for breakfast though. Los Fogones Tapas. Give us a wave. Is it good? Bueno? Very good. Very nice. English breakfast? Yeah. Two ninety nine. Yeah. Something like that. Yeah. Something like that. Yeah. Pint of beer. Yeah. Yeah. Could live here, couldn't you? Yeah. <laughs> to casa con centri venti uno punto es. Century 21. They sold our house in America, actually. So Hotel Ponderosa in the background. This is the Hotel Grand Tina Fini. Actually, I'm not going to go that way. I'm going to walk down just to this bit here, where the hammockers are also six euros. So those are asking if there's beds on the beach. There are in Costa Adeje. So pretty cool. We're at level one now, which really means that uh, very, very few restrictions. Bars can open till 3 a.m. And the only thing you've got to keep up is social distancing. So as long as you can social distance, you are able to walk around without a mask. Entering places and uh, sitting down to eat, you need to stick it on short term. But as soon as you sat down and uh, I mean, theoretically, they say when you're eating, but typically people, as soon as they sit down, they take the mask off to order and stuff. So there, Playa del Bobo. He's a famous DJ from Switzerland. DJ Bobo. So this is where we're going to start off tomorrow. If I can find a parking spot. I think there's a car park here somewhere. So we're going to nip up to see where the car park is. And I shall spend the money for you guys. If I've got it already. Uh, tomorrow's balcony banter, if anybody's interested, is competition. And Giuliani's going to be there live with us on the balcony. And we're going to have a look at one of her videos to do with competition. So that'd be quite nice. Now, I came up to this square now. And because of all the concrete, it's reflecting the heat and it's getting rather hot. Not a cloud, well, a wispy cloud in the sky. 
and it looks like they're doing something here. I don't know what, but uh, they usually have some sort of events on the square, so they might be preparing for that. Let's have a look through here and over. No, it's just, just blocking it off for some reason. So get all your tobacco and your shoes here. This is Grandma's garden, El Jardín de la Abuela. You can book by calling that number and you can only get paella with booking. <coughs> Excuse me. Closed on Tuesdays, open in the evenings though. So, <coughs> oh, I've got sneezes, probably the sun in my eyes. And we've got heads and tails. On the back road to Berlin. Today's special pork baguettes with stuffing and applesauce, 450. Heads and tails roast dinner. Book now. Doesn't say what the price is. And we got live music as well. And five course menu for 850. And up here is Flavours Restaurant. Italian restaurant. Mix eggs with flour and sell it for a fortune. This is, in a, this is either an old biker's meetup or they're renting these, I'm not sure. Sal Etienne. What's Tien? I know Sal is salt. I can't remember what Tien is. Beep, 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 beep. I'll just tell you it for you, right? I'll do it for you. And if you're a spa spotter like me, there you go. There's a spa. Spa, which is German for safe, which is amazing. Oh, beautiful views there. So these are all the things that you can't do on the pedestrian zone. So you can't ride those bikes for fun, cars, segways, electric scooters or motorbikes, and those uh, two man boogies you're not allowed but nobody nobody cares I don't think do we go up here or do we go oh, that's the one we go up here we go here we go here we go so what we're going to do we're going to walk around there's the H10 casino Villa floor in the background ah, here's a parking which is 53 euros for 30 days. Open 24 hours. I don't want to stay 30 days. I mean, who would park a car for 30 days? That's a bit stupid. Here we go, live on YouTube. Where are you guys from? From Leeds. From Leeds. Leeds, 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 Leeds. You know the Mac master, do you? The Mac master, Lee Davy. He's from Leeds, he does, he does Tenerife vlogs. And eats fish and chips all the time. There you go. Always like to do that. Leeds, Leeds, Leeds. Has anybody ever been to Leeds? I've never been. Supermarket. Actually, really, I'm going to take my life in my hands here because I've missed. Oh, no, there it is. See, children, you've only got to walk an extra 10 meters 
and then you get to a zebra crossing. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Take my life in my hands. <clears throat> and we're at the Fund Grubi, which is like the found grotto. And so, ladies and gentlemen, here we are in the deepest Costa Adeje, and we're going to go round the corner here into the jungle. And here's some really natural uh, habitats of people that actually live here. Oh, take me life in my hands. And here we go straight into the back of the jungle here. It's a lovely little place just at the back of Sal Etienne. And here are some residential areas right in the beautiful Costa Adeje. Oh, it smells nice here because they've watered the grass and freshly mown as well. I can hear them moaning as we speak. <laughs> oh yeah. So let's walk up here. In the distance here, you can see Los Agaves, which is a little shopping center with a cafe, a butcher's and a fruteria. Wanna see us? Oh, a nice little bit of shade here in the trees. Oh, it's nice and quiet here. Let's have a sit on a bench and see what you guys are saying. How long have we been on? 32 minutes, perfect timing. Perfect timing. Sit me down. Oh. Morning, Tim says Emily. David, you sound like the old snoop commentator. What's his, I can't remember. I know who you mean, though. Johnny's got a hangover, too many beers, and big Indian last night. I saw the beginning of the vlog, Johnny. Uh, he's just done some island with Daniel. He has. Take my life in my hands, says Stuart. Uh, well done, you great Tenerife vlogs. So if you, if you haven't seen Johnny Vlogger, he was uh, on our Monday meetup last week, and he's been doing a lot of lives from here. He had to clean his lens last night, though. Attention, so they put the sign so high up you can't read it. Probably. <laughs> You're meeting up with Darren John, Tim. I think he's over today. Yes, he is. Uh, he'll contact me when he's ready, because he's. I, I think he's really here for a holiday, so he doesn't really want to go doing stuff, but uh, he's only just in the next village, so I'm sure we will meet up. Gesundheit, thank you very much. Wasn't there a nightclub underneath there somewhere, floor collapse? Yeah, there, that was it, that was the place. Uh, usually go on the end doing sand sculptures, I don't think I got that far. Still can't dance in the bars. No, there's no dancing, but I mean, I couldn't dance anyway. The worst trader on the island, amen. Was that fun, Groovy? Uh, close chain two, says Keris. Was that Marco Polo's? Oh, that was Marco Polo's, yeah, we got there. Lots of joggers. John Barrow, grab a coffee tin. Thank you so much. Thank you so much there. Ah, morning, Tim. I had many happy an hour sat on those benches. Oh, we get right, we're back there. Thank you, John. John's over at the moment, I believe. So we're definitely going to meet up. And uh, going to meet up with some other guys. Next Monday, if you're on the island, don't forget. 473 to Chaos Avaki. Joe and Bruce yesterday got off in the village Chaos Avaki, but got off at the bus stop El Habli. And you have to actually wait until you get to the bus stop called Chaos Avaki in Chaos Avaki. And then that'll be right next to the Nebula restaurant, and we're above the Nebula restaurant. So you've got to go basically behind the Nebula restaurant and up the stairs. 
But if you are, uh, if you have got mobility problems, there is a lift as well. So just go behind the Nebula restaurant and uh, there's a lift and stairs right there. Cool. So this is Los Agaves. Agaves are like the plants with the big leaves. They look like aloe vera and they make uh, sugary stuff out of it, sugary drinks. And uh, like syrup, like maple syrup and uh, something like tequila as well, I think. What the hell is this? There we go. More benches, more pedestrian areas, beautiful little bungalows. Well, two tier bungalows, so they're houses then. <laughs> you know why they're called bungalows, don't you? Warning, dad joke. Because the bungalow roof on them. So, let's see. For British, on the right, on the left. What is this? See? There you go. Actually, I need something from the shop, but I don't know where I can take my camera in. What shall I do? I'll go another day. I don't need it for tonight. Oh, they're actually closed anyway, I think, because it's a uh, holiday today. It looks like they might be open though. But it is Canary Day today. So that's why probably this a bit quieter than normal. Mercadon is shut. But two Tribal is open. So if I want to go get some stuff. So what do I do? Shall I walk up here? and go past, yeah, that's what I'll do. That's more interesting for you guys. So I'm gonna walk up here, which actually takes you to the magma, which is the, yep, can't drive. Get a bus through there, mate. Take my life in my hands. I'm actually taking my life in my hands, calling people out. <laughs> Uh, what we got up here? So those of you who know the magma, this is where we're coming up to now. And at the top of the road here, if you turn left, you get to the Estación de Guaguas, which is the San Eugenio bus station. And the hospital, Pheasant Plucker, all those bars on the right. And the Bougainville player, which we'll see tomorrow. But I'm most of the In the background, you can see Siam Park. So we're very close to Siam Park. And you can go up by the magma and over the motorway. We'll get the free bus you can see there in the background. With the open top bus. I do hear that conflicting reports of mask wearing on slides or not. I'm not sure. But I'm sure it'll be on their website if you're interested. So, I might park up here tomorrow, if there's a spot, and walk down. So I'll show you the bus stop. So on top of the hill, we'll walk a bit further, find a little spot in the shade, and then we'll see what you're saying. Tenerife Tours. It's a beautiful little walkway. It's not in the shade, but it'll do. Hey, hey, hey. I can't see a thing. I can't see a thing. I've got to get in the shade. There we go.
Uh, wrap up well, Anne, says Heather. Yvonne Morning, David Butler, hello from down the road in sunny Playa de las Americas. Whereabouts are you, guys? So you has got to go. See you. Thanks for everything, Denise. Nice to see you on your walks again. Johnny Vlogger, 480 subs, 20 off the 500. There you go. Go and support Johnny Vlogger if you like that type of thing. He does lives and karaoke on a Friday and uh, walks in Tenerife when he's here. So go and support Johnny Vlogger. Let's see what else we got. Ian's going. Heather. Uh, everybody saying goodbye to Ian. He will be there on Wednesday, live at 5.55, hopefully. <laughs> so this is the main road from San Eugenio to Playa de las Americas. Oh, here's a nice bench in the shade, but I've already sat now, so we kind of do it. We need it. So here's the magma. And if you go up that road next to the magma, you can come over to uh, Siam Park. There's the Siam Park free bus again. There must be more than one. And we go this way. Beautiful little area. There's a nice little green down here that people lie on at lunchtime, have their lunch for the people working around. Beautiful place. None of this keep off the grass up here. So, we're gonna go down this road here and then come back by Lineker's to the car. Hope you haven't been nicked. Why would it be nicked, they say. That's true. Oh, a beautiful morning. Oh, what a beautiful morning. Oh, what a beautiful day. I've got a wonderful feeling. Everything's going my way. Yes, it is. No, it isn't. Oh, that's another one, isn't it? Anybody know the second verse of that? Join in. Well, I can't join in because I don't know it. <laughs> so here's the Twin Towers. I've actually never noticed them before. <laughs> That's amazing, isn't it? Probably looks different from the other side. Atlas car rentals. So this is the apartments. Oh, what are they called? A lot of people stay here. Can't remember what they're called now. Not going to go down. Two points if you know what they're called. And that's back down to Playa La Troya. So I'm going to take my life in my hands. Ah, this looks like a nice place on the corner. Don't believe him. Get a taxi. <laughs> so we're in the corner. If you're following along on Google Maps of uh, Avenida Centario, 
via via Cesare and Calle Bolivia. Bolivia. So, which way are we gonna go? Down here? Yeah. Let's go down here. Can I social distance on it? I think I can. Tina pizza here. Good little Tina. So, don't feed these people. So we're coming down now to the bottom roundabout where people take a shortcut. So they come from the police station in Las Americas down here and then turn up here to go towards the Golden Mile. So the top of that hill there is uh, those hotels, what is it called, Oro and Blanco. Gold and white. I can't remember what they're called. Now, if you remember, if you've seen one of my walks before, I've done this barranco that we're coming up to. So I could theoretically go down there back to Playa La Troya and Veronica's, but because you've already seen that, I'm gonna go up the hill. Well, not up the hill, actually. Just before the start of the hill, I'm gonna turn right and uh, take you back down past Linica's and all that play tramps. So that'd be quite nice. Let's see if we can social distance here. Took me life in my hands, Kurt's fisting, as they say. So this is the Barranco where you can walk down. This is the border between Las Americas and Playa. Uh, Costa Deque, I mean. So for those of you who haven't seen that walk, I'll link it at the top here somewhere. At 47 minutes and 41 seconds. 47, 41. And the palm trees at the top there is the top road. So, which I think is quicker, to tell you the truth, and less hassle. So. La Brochetta, restaurant and pizzeria. Looks like it's downstairs and not open for breakfast. We've got a real estate agent and a tattoo parlor. Then we've got the shisha and cocktail bar Fuego and a supermarket that's for rent. Man, he wasn't doing any good because you can't get in. Oh no, it's around the corner. <laughs> Let the dog out the corner. So, hot pot, pasta, rice, and soup. Grand Bazaar. Oh, this is Playa Azul or Blue Beach. That's why I've never seen it before. I don't come down here that often. Paladero 2, or Paladero 2, as they say. Mini market coffees. Fags in the street. That's one thing I hope they do keep is the smoke smoking ban. It's been nice to not have to smell it. 
And if I can smell your smoke, I can smell your COVID, as they say. Ginger, vegan restaurant. Ludexi, or is it Ludexi? Is that an L? Apartments, Paradero Dos. That's a nice thing. Torres de Yomeli, the Towers of Yomeli. This looks quite nice. Booking here, Chez Damien restaurant. This looks quite modern, actually. Never seen this before. Oh, this is Vanilla Garden Hotel. And wheelchair friendly. Oh, that's quite nice, actually. And I suppose the uh, restaurant's open to the public. And it's just off Veronica's. Torres de Yomeli Apartamentos. The Towers of Yomeli. Yep. Bus coming. Being patient. There's another hotel. A hotel gala. How do I get across now? I missed it because he was parked on it, that's why. Egypt. Take me life in my hands. Oh, nice here. Ten twenty now. Socially distance. Park in here as well. So, La Margarita, pizzeria, and pasta and steakhouse. The Irish Oak, LA. Oh, it must have been the same people who had the Irish Oak somewhere else, next to Murphy's Irish Bar. Or is it the same one? Oh, they're in competition now. Well, that'll be interesting. Oops, and took my life in my hands there. You didn't see that going. You have to be careful, my old Chinas. This is an Irish Oak, LA. Lineker's Barn. The Highlander. <laughs> Supermarket. Oh, that one is the, uh, I was thinking about doing an excursion this week, maybe. So, uh, the twin skis. City Food Magic Mike, there you go. Was he a magician or a dancer? There you go. Donna Kebab. The Obscura Gourmet Cafe and Takeaway. That looks good. A gourmet cafe. And Dialpri. Is that the same, Donna Kebab? Or a different one? Cheapest prices for tobacco. Oh, amazing. And there we go. Back to Veronica's. My car has not been nicked, which is good.
Looking for breakfast, probably. Right, people. Here we go. I'm, uh, I'm actually going to go down here to finish up. I'm going to go down the, uh, down the ramp. There you go. So it's coming up to 55 minutes. So it'll give me five minutes to sit in the shade and have a look to see what you're saying. And then I can get home, do breakfast for Christina Lee. Donna's coming this afternoon. We're going to learn Spanish, Spanish with Paul. I don't get paid for saying that, but it is one of the best ways for English people to learn Spanish or English speakers to learn Spanish, should I say. And uh, check him out on YouTube, Spanish with Paul. And he does 10 free lessons in a course, a mini course, which I recommend you do in order. And then he does uh, another sort of 20 videos that give you sort of speciality stuff. And uh, then he gives you the opportunity to buy his course. So once you've bought the course, you get access to his whole thing. And then he offers uh, other added extras, which uh, some of them are worth it, buy the vocabulary course, if you want to do that. And there is also a comprehension course where they speak and you have to listen and see if you understand it, which is good. I bought that, but I just don't have time to listen to it. I'm going to have to stick it on my earphones and, and let it run in the background. So we'll see that. Not Spanish with Paul, the normal course. Uh, if you sign up for his newsletter, you get 50% off. So it's usually 200 and you get it for 99. Right, Craig saying goodbye. Have a good day. I'm going to go backwards. ABC says Craig had a great St. Paddy's night in Murphy's. Are you going to see Rick and Shelley? And morning, Tim. We walk down there. Say the old lady tropical. Cool. All you got to do is find the bus stop with Cyan Mall. I think it's the bus is hourly. But check the website. Yep. But you, you can actually walk it from from anywhere around here. Uh, best hotel any good? And is the best hotel any good? Okay. Simon Una. Okay, good morning, Alison. See the bus going to Simon Mall. I'm not 100% sure. Free? I think it is free. If it says Simon, if it says Simon Mall on it, it's free. I think. Uh, we are in Hotel Best Tim behind the Safari. Okay. I'm getting bitten by lots of little flies now, so they're drinking my sweat. Let's turn you around. Bye, everybody, as they're saying. So let's see if I can go down the, the ramp again to show you how wheelchair-friendly this place is. This is the Tunnel to Veronica's. And we just carry straight on down the ramp. Rampo to Rags. Rags to riches, there you go. Tramps, cocos, and the top floors for rent. And there's the show bar. And this way, back to the car. So it's got music playing, so I've got to keep talking, keep on talking so they don't uncha, uncha, uncha me. And there we go. Here's the car. Realise I've got to wash it. And we'll have the, uh, the things in the background. There we go. Let's turn this around. And where are they? Oh, there they are. Okay. So let's go up. That's better. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, experience, thank you for coming with me today. Tomorrow we're going to start off around about where we left off. And that's the casino area. I'll probably park up by the magma and walk down. And then we'll walk around the top end of uh, the bottom end. And then up to San Eugenio, back by the Borgenville Playa and back through to the bus station. So we'll get a nice little beach and bus station view there. And let's uh, just see what you guys said. Great hotel outdated. Okay, having a chat amongst yourselves. This is really good. So I'm going to finish it here. Thanks a lot for joining me again today. I'd like to thank each and every one of you individually for all your support. 
those people that are members and support regular, those people that donate online, and those people that watch the adverts. Thank you so much. Every little helps. Uh, if you want to go and uh, support the channel anonymously, go to timothydow.com, and there is a link to PayPal where you can do a friends and family transfer, and we get 100% of that, so that would be really nice. And if you're on the island, don't forget we've got Monday Meetup in Kao Savaki. And uh, if you've made it this far and you're the first time here, then uh, I hope you enjoyed yourself. And Google thinks you might like this one next. And as I said, if you want to donate anonymously, you can go to the website. And if you're still not subscribed, you can subscribe for free right here. This is Tim Dowd for Living With MS in Tenerife, signing off. See ya. Wouldn't want to be ya. Bye.